All right. Hey, 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 Coach Miner here. Hope all is well. And my first guest inside the studio is Mr. None other, the man himself, Mr. Robert Healy. Robbie yes, Healy, how you doing, sir? I'm good. I'm good. How you doing? I'm doing well, man. Doing well. Yeah. Glad to have you, man. I appreciate you taking time. I know you're busy. Got a lot of stuff going on. Of and course. So thanks so much for taking the time. I appreciate it, man. So listen. Of course. Real, real cool, real casual. A uh, few questions. Answer at will, man. We'll have some fun with this thing and, and uh, cool. go from there. Uh, okay. So let me go ahead and dive in. Listen, we, the elephant in the, in the room really is, you know, how are you and your family holding up right now with everything going on in the quarantine with COVID-19? Yeah, well, I think, I mean, we, we're, we're a pretty tight-knit family already, so sure. it's, it's actually been pretty good. We've, uh, we've, we've made a, a pickleball court out in the, the driveway. <laughs> nice. we, we taped it out and got a net nice. and everything, so that's nice. pretty cool. And, I mean, I've, I've definitely had some fights with my sisters, you know. It's, it's, it's kind of inevitable. To be but, expected, to be yeah, expected, yeah. right? Yeah, but, but the next day, you know, or, you know, only a couple hours later or whatever, you, just, you, you make up, you move on, and uh, – and to uh, to spend more time with Campbell, we've all been uh, nice. playing video games in the same room nice. together. <laughs> so nice. It's, nice. it's pretty funny, no. but uh, but yeah, and we 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 have this like chore chart and everything. And okay, so, okay. Yeah. So what, what, what chore do you have? What are you doing most of? Um, today Thursday. I have the dishes today. Nice. Yeah. It's funny. So that's like my therapy. I do I do them almost every day. Yeah. It's kind of yeah. like how, how I kind of put my headphones on, man. I go in my world. My really? Yeah. Music. Yeah. Cool. Good for you, man. Good for you. Awesome. Okay. Appreciate that. Okay. So listen, we, we, we know all this is going on. We know lives have been lost, and that's the that's the, the worst part, the saddest part about this whole situation. Yeah. But you know, but what do you focus on um as far as reminding yourself as far as gratitude and how how you know how thankful you are? What do you think about? You have any rituals at all you do or any routines? Yeah. Um well for our family, it's been, you know, kind of pretty tough with my grandma and everything as well. So yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. It it's okay. Yeah, we're we're good now. But we're it it kind of just, you know, that even and COVID and everything just puts everything into perspective. So, I mean, I'm I'm lucky enough to have that, you know, the amazing, you know, the the water view. So yeah, I, I sometimes just go up there and you know just think about what's going on and it, it almost feels like a movie, you know. So. Sure. It's, you, I, I kind of just sit up there and think about the times with my friends and, you know, times with my grandma and all that. And it's like, it, it kind of grounds you and you're like, okay, like if, if like you, you just remember how, how good life yeah. was and you, you, you realize like, okay, once I get out of here, like I'm not going to take anything for granted. <laughs> like again, yeah. even, yeah. even as simple as like, you know, driving to downtown, getting some food or something. <laughs> right. like it's, it's just the little things, you know? So it's so true, man. You're exactly right. It's so little things that sometimes we get we get lost in translation with our daily lives, right? With the cell yeah, phone yeah. and everything else going on, and yeah, for you sure. know, just to be able to kind of kind of decompose and 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 to step back and say thank you. So good, thank you for that. Appreciate you, yeah, yeah. Robbie. Mm -hmm. um, listen, I know you can't speak for all the seniors, but um, with everything <laughs> going on, and of course that that just kind of puts the the, the kind of a the snowball effect on all the senior events that are supposed to happen, and unfortunately. Yeah. I, 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 Sands my heart. You know, how do you feel about that from your perspective and, and, and from your friends you talk to? What are your thoughts on that? Um, I think it's kind of a range, really, in okay. the senior class. Like, like okay. some people are really devastated by it. Um, but me, I'm kind of thinking, I mean, it's out of our control. You sure. know, it kind of, it kind of is that idea, like, it is yeah. what it is, you know, yeah. and you, you got to roll with the punches. Um, so I'm, I'm definitely sad. Like I, I wish I could say, you know, I had senior night and all that and yeah. we might have it. I don't know. I mean, sure. Know sure. Never know. Right. Exactly. But, um, but if we don't, I, I'm just glad that on the last day of school, we just like lived it. Like it was our last, you know, yeah. So yeah. we had like a bathroom party and all that. And so <laughs> we had a good time, but, uh, but, we'll, edit that, we'll edit that out. No. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> no, I'm, kidding. Dave, I'm kidding. Dave, Dave, Dave didn't see that. <laughs> yeah. I love it, man. I love but, it. I love um, it. I love but it. Yeah. So, I mean, it's, I, I, I think I'm, I'm definitely sad about it, but you know, sure. like that, that, that John Krasinski thing where he did, he did like that online prom. Like yeah. That was yeah. Really cool. And, yeah. Um, you know, where, where, where there's a will, there's a way to make stuff happen. So like so John true. Krasinski, like he had that online prom and then, I don't know. I mean, maybe I could set up some Zoom or something with all the sure. all the guys or all the, all the senior people and try to do yeah. something. So no, no, 
I think I think you're right, man. I think the perspective is huge, and, and I appreciate you saying that. And I know from the from the St. Martin's community, from our from the teachers and administration, we 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 we, our heart goes out to you guys, man. Because we know yeah. you know you look forward to those things and senior night and, and prom and yeah. everything like that. So uh, you know, love to have a miracle and that happens, but if it doesn't, I appreciate your focus. Appreciate mm -hmm. you know your your attitude toward the means of the world. Yeah. All right, man. Let's dive into something really I'm excited about, man. So I've, I've had a chance to know you for a long time now, and. All of you talked about was going to West Point. West yeah. Point, West Point, West Point. I don't know West Point. Sure. Hey, shut up. I don't even know about West Point. Um, and let me say, man, I am, besides your parents, man, I am so proud of you, brother. I really you. am. You've worked so hard. You're a great young man. And you put the time and effort to make it happen. So tell me about West Point, my friend. Yes, sir. Congratulations. Well, I mean, you know, right, right now, uh, it's actually kind of funny because to, to actually – I mean, they have the whole insane process, as you know, to apply yeah. and everything. And then after all that's over, now they have all of these like intake procedures okay. where it's like dental requirements, immunization <laughs> requirements and everything. And I'm like, I'm like, how am I supposed to go and do all this if I'm on lockdown? So, so the only one I've been able to do is my dentist was like, okay, gotcha. that, that kind of sounds like an emergency, like. And we went decked out with like the masks and everything. And fully ready. I got you. Yeah, I got yeah. you. So that's I got cool, that man. done. But, uh, that's cool. Yeah, but it, it's definitely kind of a little struggle right now. But that's okay. <laughs> but but yeah, I'm 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 definitely excited. Um, you should be, man. You should be. That's I, awesome. but but I'm I'm also I'm also scared to be honest. Sure. Um, Appreciate but that. I, I I just hope that um, I hope that we get out of this quarantine for a little bit, so I can have time to kind of celebrate with my friends a bit because. If I go straight from the quarantine, right, to be <laughs> right, West Point. that would be a sad, ah, sad Oh, man. Fellow. <laughs> that, would be, that would be tough. That, that would, would be, be tough. very tough. Well, listen, when, when we can't celebrate, man, we'll, we'll get back, go back to our favorite restaurant, and it'll, it'll be on me. Yeah, uh, yeah, for I'll sure. Treat, look forward to that. <laughs> um, so, again, congrats on that. So, let me uh, uh, kind of a uh, kind of a spin on that question. You know, I know Pops, you know, you know, is a um, – as a West Point grad and, yeah. and, and has done some great things in the military and, and, and appreciate his service, you know, was the decision to go there anything based on him at all? It was totally up to you. Was it, is there any influence there? So I think, um, I think the original thought obviously was, was from him because we used to go to, you know, all the West Point football games and okay. um, go and see the campus and everything. And um, it's, it's almost like I kind of felt, the the connection there okay. when, when, I, when, when I was really young as well so so I think he definitely kind of sparked it but then throughout this whole process every time I would talk to him about West Point he would say this is your decision this is your decision like that's you have cool. to decide because that's cool because it's like I mean from what I've heard you know um <laughs> it's uh it's definitely a place where if sure. you if your heart's not completely into it you're you're gonna be in a in a b bad place probably yeah. so so um i i definitely i was kind of going back and forth on do i want to do rtc or do i want to do west point like fully dive into military or sure. go half and half kind of sure. college military and i just at the end of the day like i just i just thought about you know like my kind of what i want to do in life is like you know use what I learned to like serve others so sure. so I thought like what would the best way to do that be and that would be going to West Point that's awesome and that's um awesome. I mean I've and just like from the success of my dad and all of his friends that are West Pointers it's like it, yeah. it's almost a no-brainer like you, you yeah. it, it really sets you up so I I think I only a couple weeks before I decided I actually knew that I was gonna <laughs> choose West Point Shit, but that's awesome man Good but um Good but I my, my heart is into it now and I think that you know wh whatever whatever craziness I'm gonna have to deal with there I, I think I'm ready for I'm, I'm definitely scared but sure, sure. I, I, I think I'm ready for it um you'll, you'll, you'll pull through man you'll pull yeah, through. It's, yeah. It's, it's funny because your, your dad's told me some of the West Point stories man they're, they're, they're pretty pretty hardcore down there man yeah so, yeah exactly um the, the great thing about it is that every year now we can bet now because I'm a Notre Dame guy you're an army guy yeah, so yeah. when they play baby we yeah. dinner's on you because we're gonna beat you every single time <laughs> well last year la last year you probably would have beaten us because we're all hurt, but, you <laughs> I know, know I know I know the, the next few Good years stuff. who knows we'll, we'll Good see stuff. we'll see what happens <laughs> so so um you know what? What does what Robbie loves doing in his free time? What, what does Robbie enjoy when he's when he's by himself? 
you know, I know I know you love your friend time, but when you're by yourself, doors yeah, closed, yeah. nobody's around. What is what is Robbie doing? Um, well, lately we've been playing a lot of pickleball. Okay, kind of kind of funny, but uh, but um, you know, that's it's it's one of the one of the only things we can do. But we also have the little you know the little what do we call it the the, the spool the spot yeah, the spot pool. pool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we, I we go on that too and just relax a little bit. And, um, okay. and also like we're, we're trying to, I mean, Campbell has been taking it a little harder than I'm us. Sure. So I'm sure. I'm um, sure. Oh, he's Campbell. been having a little trouble, like not being able to see oh. your friends and everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I'm sure. I'm sure. So we, we make sure to like do a lot of things with her and like, okay, mm -hmm. I'm, I, I don't want to sound like I'm addicted to computers right now, but like, come on, like we kind of all are. And like, I'm playing, I'm, yeah. I'm playing, I'm playing lots of video games. So, nice. so I, I go into Campbell's room and like we we play like Minecraft and stuff together, like nice. like the PG games. Nice. <laughs> no, I I get it, man. I get it. My 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 boys are are on there like nonstop. Like I'm like, yeah, yeah. It's like ten thirty midnight. Can you turn it off? Right. So yeah, you know, yeah. So you try I, to find. I, I, yeah, I do try tough. to get out though sometimes. Yeah. Like, like I'll. Like if I have classes all day, okay, and like I'll try to limit the the gaming time because then okay. it just screens the whole entire day. Sure, no, but, I, I, to, um, I totally get that. I totally understand. Yeah, yeah. But well, if good, I don't have stuff. any, if I don't have any classes during the day, you, you know I'm going. Like I, I know, I already know what you're doing. One, you know? I know what you're doing. I already know. I already know. <laughs> I already know. I appreciate. It. That's awesome, man. Yeah. Listen, we'll, we'll bring this thing, bring this thing in for landing pretty soon here. Um. So listen, senior now. Um, the time has come for you kind of to kind of submit, you know, your last stage at St. Margaret's and kind of move on to bigger and better things. Yeah, so, yeah. you know, how, how does Robbie want to be remembered, you know, at St. Margaret's? Um, well, first off, as a class, I think, you know, it's going to be hard to forget us just because yeah. the, the, the situation. 100%. Yeah, yeah. But, but, but I kind of, as a class, I want to be known for, you know, like the, the, the class who, you know, still, still made things happen. Like even, even though, like we, we got creative, I guess, because sure. yeah. even, even though we can't do all these things, like I, I, I see on my, you know, Instagram and all that, like people are doing the social distancing meetups where it's like cars are all spaced out and everything. And like, you know, yeah. people are still making it happen. And yeah. I, I think it's really cool because, you know, we're all, we're all really creative people. And even though we, we can't be together, we're, we're figuring out a way to still be close. And yeah, you know, humans are very social um, animals, so we definitely need that connection. Yeah, um, we do. We're we still, do. We're, we're still making it happen, which is cool, but while being safe. So um, I, I think it's really cool that we're doing that, and I, I think we should kind of be remembered as that class who, um, you know, let kind of let, led the school through a tough time. And sure. um, I, I hope that we can um, – come back when it's normal and you know kind of kind of end it the right way but um but I mean me personally um I think that I I want to be known as someone who you know really really cared for people in the community okay, um, okay. I think that I I mean I I try to come to school every day with a positive attitude and a yeah. smile on my face um yeah yeah yeah. There's a, uh, I mean, there's been some moments where it's tough and, you know, I might have a bad day and it's rough to keep being positive to people, but, you know, I'm, I'm always trying my best to be, you know, the kind of that light in people's days. Um, and I hope that for a lot of people, I, I was that. Um, That's awesome. And I mean, there's other stuff, you know, football wise and all that, that I want to be remembered for, but I think just that, sure. that basic idea of, you know, being a, a friendly, you know, good presence on sure. campus is sure. what I want to be remembered for. So, no, I, I'll definitely remember you for many things, man. You've been uh, so so instrumental in my life. You really have, and so it's it's going to be tough yeah. to see you go. It really is. Yeah, it's yeah. Be tough to see you go. We've we've had some some great times together uh, at school, away from school. Some great bond experiences. So Painting I'm, the I'm, fence. I'm, I'm missed that. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Painting the fence, right? Late, late night spa conversations. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. But uh, but, but don't worry. We'll we'll definitely stay in contact and connect for sure. And we'll for sure. Out, you know, I'll fly out to the East Coast and hang out whatever. So yes, sir. We'll make it. We'll make it work, man. Don't worry about that. Sounds good. All right. Let me bring something for Landy, man. So the last question. Um, mm -hmm. 
So you're you're on stage, you're talking to the community of St. Margaret's and to your to your fellow classmates, you know, what, yeah. what, what do you say? Um I mean, definitely I I don't think I could say anything else except for something about what's going on right now, but um but um you know, I would just say you you're never going to have another time like this again. Um I don't want to jinx it. Hopefully we don't have another time like this again, but, but I, don't, I don't think we're ever going to have another time like this again. And I, I really think just, you know, just slow down and because th these days have been going by like very fast for me. Yeah. And like, yeah. I got to remind myself that I just got to slow down and yeah. I would say slow down and really make sure that you create times where you can just spend it with your family yeah and instead of you know going down into your rooms and you know just doing whatever like we my family has been you know setting up a couple risk games per week and stuff and That's awesome. you know you, you know my dad and me are winning I do. Those, but uh, i know i know i know yeah. i already know i already <laughs> and, yeah. know and and we played like we're, we're playing like these games on the tv like trivia games and all that and so we're like i, I really think it's just slow down and make time for your family because sure. you, you can be sitting there and be missing all of your friends and missing everything else. And then you just completely forget about like, wow, like I actually can spend all this time with my family too. Yeah. So that's, that's a great point. Yeah. Because, because point. I'm out, I'm out of the house. Like, like I was, you know, I was making the most of senior year. Like I was yeah. almost every night I was out of the house, like yeah. going to get ice cream or something like that. And that's like, I, I, I wasn't with my family a lot. So yeah. It's almost like you know someone saying be with your family more yeah. I don't know, but uh, yeah no it's a good it's, point it, it, it's uh it's been pretty cool yeah. i mean it, it's been tough a few times just because sure, of course of I course mean, you know campbell goes a little crazy sometimes but course, you know <laughs> that's Cammy. that's Cammy. That's <laughs> exactly well hey listen i i appreciate you coming on the first inaugural from minor minutes to minor interviews yes sir uh, and thank you for having me and again it's been an honor and a pleasure and a privilege my man you yeah, know, we got, I have you. to tell you, we, we, we go way back. You already yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, cool. But tell your family I said hello and I'll give them a big hug kiss for me as well as for Cammie. And uh, cool. I appreciate you and talk to you soon, my dude. Appreciate you. It's, yeah. Anytime, brother. Be good. Talk to you okay. soon. Deuces. Deuces. Stay safe, my man. <laughs> you too, brother. Be yeah, good. Thank you so much. See ya. Anytime. Bye-bye.